so normally I save this uh, channel and my YouTube channel for gaming and anything gaming and geeky and nerdy related, but um, given that I'm a whole rounded person, I thought, uh, and I don't have any other channels, but I'm thinking of making one, um, I figured I would show you guys what I'm up to today. I um, tomorrow I'm going to get a tooth pulled and I'm just not feeling super great about that or, or the tooth in general. So I'm making a deep cleaning list for, uh, when I feel better. Cause we've got, uh, some friends coming into town <laughs> ironically tomorrow after I get this tooth pulled. So hopefully I will feel, uh, up to doing this before they show up. And it's always a good idea to have these lists on hand because, trust me, I have seen some things and this just helps. So I'm using Canva for editing templates and things. Oh, look, it's hubby. Hi, hubby. Yes. Okay, yeah, his comment does show up, so I'm not crazy. Yes, I'm just using Canva because I'm not actually good at designing anything in real life. Um, I have these two, and I've used this one already. Like this one, I made one for the bathroom and one for the kitchen. The one for the bathroom actually turned out a lot better than the one for the kitchen. Because every time I tried to print this one, it would cut it off, like right at the window seal. So it would take off like all this down here and it just looked awful. So I ended up having to print it in like landscape. So it's small, but you know, at least it's all there. So I don't know if I want to keep using this template because of that because I really don't want to waste all of our ink. Um, but yeah, so this one is a spring cleaning checklist, but the problem with that is that then I can't, my goal is to tape these individual lists like to like the cabinet above the washer or the one above the bathroom, just so it stays in that room that it's for. And if I do it like this, then whoever has this list has to kind of carry it around with them all day. So, um, this one could work, but it's got two pages and I don't need all that for the same reason. Thank you for that. My little precious husband just messaged me and said, boring stream. Well, at least I stream something. That could work. That's cute, right? That's cute. That's also cute. I like that one. Which one? Mm. Oops. That one's cute, and then it has a little check things next to it, but that only works if we're going to throw it away. And I'm just going to leave this there. Like, it's just going to stay taped up somewhere. So, um, I'm probably going to use this one. Let's see what happens. And this one I'm going to use for the living room. So, let's call it living room deep, deep clean list. And everyone can yell at me later. <laughs> Ooh. Nice. I like Call of Duty. But I did call in sick to work today, so um, I I really did have horrible tooth pain 
all night, a lot this morning. Um, I cannot believe it's one o'clock and I have accomplished borderline nothing. So, um, I wouldn't feel right about just like gaming. So I want to do something sort of productive. So that's why I'm doing this because <laughs> it's the easiest thing in the world. But then, yes, I absolutely want to do some gaming later when I feel like I've deserved it. Okay, so the first thing that I would want on my deep clean list is uh, dusting. So let's go, let's do ceiling fans first, actually, because that doesn't get done ever. Is that how you spell ceiling? Uh, let's call it dust ceiling fan. It was clearly not how you spell ceiling. Okay. Dust ceiling fan. All shelves. When I say all shelves, let me just make that two things. So, all the shelves, um, our entertainment center really isn't an entertainment center, it's just, it literally is just, like, the spot where our TV sits and our Xboxes and whatnot. I do not like how that is all kinds of in the way, so, there's gonna be a gap there. Because I'm not a designer, and no one's going to look at this list but me. Then, um, let's go with wipe down couch. I do have a certain cleaner I like to wipe down our couches with, just so they don't get germy and gross and, you know, smell like dogs. That's one thing I really like about uh, leather or fake leather. Oh. Love you, precious. I don't know why I'm, I usually see it on my other screen too, but this is only coming up on the one screen. So I'm actually not seeing these comments in front of my face like it appears on my screen that I am. Um, okay, wipe down the couch, and then I would pick... If I were paying someone to do it, Swiffer mop walls. That's one thing I really like to do in the spring. It's just got like the Swiffer wet mops, and you just kind of wring them out a little bit, just a little bit, so they're not like drippy. And then you just rub down the walls, and uh. When you're when you're doing that, um, you also get like the tops of the door frames and things like that. But that's common sense in our house, so I'm not going to add that here. I would love some baseboard scrubbing, but I'm not mean enough to make anyone do that but me. Let's do. Um, Mm, I can't say all furniture because we literally have one table in our living room. So. Vacuuming under the couches. That's something that never gets done in any house. And vacuum and mop. Just blanket everywhere. Um, it did not need this whole section here, um, but I will add over here, move or put, oh, organize what you can. Wash. 
Wash, throw a blanket. That's always really nice to get done. Wash dog blankets. Not together. Do not wash the throw blankets and the dog blankets together. Hmm. For our living room, it's so small. That's kind of all that really needs to be done. Oh. I guess the front. Front glass door could get wiped down. Hmm. That's it. Like, our living room is pretty small. And it's not, like, it's lived in, but it's not just, like, abused. Like, there's no trash in our living room or anything like that. Um, that's, that's it for our living room. So, I'm going to delete these. Or, yeah, I'm, I'm going to delete these and then just make everything bigger. So, I don't need these sections... This is very tedious. I probably shouldn't be streaming this because it's so tedious. And I'm not, like, speeding this up because I'm Twitch streaming it. So I apologize if you are watching and are just suffering through this with me. But I super appreciate it if you are suffering through this with me. Okay. I don't even know if this is considered a deep clean. The only thing that really makes it a deep clean is... All of the shelves getting, like, taking everything off of them and dusting. And the ceiling fan. And, oh, I guess the light fixtures on the ceiling fan. Light fixtures and lights. And the mopping the walls. That's not something that gets done every weekend. So, let's go ahead and save this. I'm not sure if maybe the PNG thing is why it's not printing how it's supposed to. Because, as you can see, this looks fine to me. But when I go to print this, it is not going to look like this. I'm going to try, but I bet you a hundred bucks it is not going to look like this once I print it off. Like, I bet all this is going to be cut off, and, like, I'm not going to be super mad if it takes off of this part, because there's nothing here. But, still. Okay, I'm going to go grab this out of the printer, and be right back. Okay, it actually did it. So this one worked pretty good. So I'm just going to keep using this template for the other sections in my house. I might actually even redo the kitchen one. The other, actually probably the other two, just because they look like trash. Okay, so that one came out cute and good and, you know, everything looks how it's supposed to. So. Let's do the dining room and then I will change the other two that did not come out well. Dep. <laughs> okay. I love a little art that you can add. It's adorable. It's like, if I'm going to have notes stuck all over my house to tell myself and my family how to clean things, it might as well look cute, right? Um, so, yeah. Now, what would a dining room... So, obviously, you wouldn't have this in a dining room. Um, let's look up, like, literally, let's look up dining room. Why don't you give me a plate? No, let's do elements. Sorry. Dining room. That's cute. 
So I'll swap that for this, even though... Instead of black, let's make it that cute brown that they're using. And then for this... Um, that is also super cute. What is that? Oh, they're stars. Not what you'd have in a dining room, though. Yeah, none of this is screaming dining room to me, except we do have a clock in our dining room, so why not? It doesn't look like this. What else could go in a dining room that's a little, little clip art looking cute stuff? Hmm. I did use these for the kids' chore charts, just this kind of basic. We do keep flowers on the table. Well, you know, some of us. Uh, but we already have those here, so we don't need that. Circle. Oh, you can do shapes. That is cute. Okay, let's do... You know those lights people string up? Like these. Yeah, like these. But none of those are screaming dining room. So let's just look up dining. I'll chuck up a plate. That's fine. And then also make this that cute brown. Okay. Works for me. Now we don't have a ceiling fan. Um, we do have a light, but uh, whoever lived here before us kind of ruined it. So we don't use it like you're supposed to. So scratch that. Honestly, the dining room is one of the toughest areas for us because our house actually doesn't have closets in no sense. And so it's not like we can just haul everything to a spare bedroom and just offload all of our crap. So I, the dining room is a spot that I really never know where to start because it's the center of our house. So I'm going to start with the table. So, clear table. Mm. I want to say wipe it down with Murphy's because we have the Murphy stuff and that makes it smell good, look good, takes care of the wood. Um, but let's do it in steps. So, clear the dining room table. Step one for those of us that get distracted and overwhelmed. Wipe table with... Murphy's. Is that how you... Okay. Hmm. Organize and put away. So whatever was on the table that I'm along there, put that shit away. Wipe down the chairs. Wipe down Grandpa's hutch. Uh, the baseboards in our dining room are never, I mean, we like just painted those, so they're probably fine for right this minute. They will need to be done eventually. Hmm. 
um, dust. It's not. It's not a door frame, but. It's kind of like a door frame. It goes from the living room to the dining room, and then we've got two going to the kitchen in the hallway. So dust door frames. Um, organize and dust. Green hutch. And that will not be there uh, here in just a little while. Um, Obviously, vacuuming and mopping. Oh, you know what? I probably shouldn't have deleted some of those sections. What do you know? So, let's add that. I don't think it was a subheading. I don't know what these boxes are, so let me just duplicate. Oh. I didn't want to duplicate the whole thing. I mean, that's fine. If I'm doing this just terribly wrong, I hope that someone would point it out, but not in like a condescending, you're stupid, go kill yourself kind of way. There we go. That's a little bit uneven. Okay, so organizing and dusting the other hutch in the dining room, which that will not be there. Uh, permanently, but it is for now. Um, the dining room is normally pretty simple. I don't know if I'll need this whole section. I'm going to leave it, and then I'll utilize this one, and we'll see. Um... Window seals. Oh, nope, I'm screaming. Just the glass part of the windows. We can swift or mop walls in here too. Wants me to capitalize Swiffer. And then vacuum and mop. I think that's it. I really don't think I needed that extra section. I was just being a blonde. That was, uh, I didn't need that. Okay. Um, and if I think of anything else, I'll just write it by hand in this section. Because the other one printed so well, I'm going to assume that this one will too. It is on portrait. All right, good to go. I'll just leave that one there and then I'll edit the next one for the bathroom. Like I said, I was using, uh, which one was it? What was I was using for the bathroom? This one. I was using this one for the bathroom, and in hindsight, it looks good, right? Because it has that nice bathroomy feel. But it's kind of hard to read, and it didn't print right. So these ones didn't work out. So I'm going to use this one for the bathroom, too.
bathroom deep clean list. I will probably want to change the color for the bathroom. Um, let's up for cuteness. Bathroom. Perfect. A toilet. There we go. That's about as big as our bathroom is, too. Check that out. And then a... Um, cute little bathroom sign. Adorable. And for this... I could chuck a soap bar in there. I would love to have a bathroom big enough to have one of those shelves that you have like all your towels on and you know. I would love to be that fancy. Perfect. That is adorable. It doesn't really fit with the way these two look though. Look at that. It's like you go go clubbing in your own bathroom. Uh I'm gonna take the plants off for this one just because uh you know. And I'll chuck it. Oh, I love these. That is so cute. Little suds. Who knew someone could be so happy about clip art? Oh, I love that too. Here, I'm going to replace this with this. That is cute. Okay. And then... Maybe this one will look better with these other than this. Even though I do think that's cute. Let's rotate that just a little. There we go. That's alright. <laughs> that's cute. Okay, I have to stop looking at this or I'm never going to actually make the list. Okay, I have this written out already, obviously. So this one will go a little faster. For this, I want the light fixtures. So the light fixtures above the sink. I want um, the door frame dusted shelves dusted wow um they did not need all that space in between them right there but I can't really edit that then let's go ahead and after oh um the window seals need to be dusted. After all that is dusted, then we can do toilet from top to floor. Around bottom as well. The entire sink, not just the inside, the fixtures, everything as well. Entire sink. I don't know how to spell faucet. I think it's like F-A-U-C-E-T, is that it? And 
and then entire shower and tub remove all items and clean then um Why is a door frame dusted and shelves dust instead of dust door frame? I'll fix that. Because that sounds confusing. Sounds like it's already been done. Um, I want the baseboards wiped. Oh. Uh, the door frame needs to be dusted, but also... sink and around the well if I add that there see that's the problem with canvas I can't like drag these around and add more and whatever I'd have to add a whole section so I'll just add that here okay so baseboards uh, the window has a sticker over it so we can't clean the window um I'm looking at what I've already wrote. Um, trash. The cabinet doors under the sink. And vacuuming and mopping. That seems fair to me. For a deep clean. Hmm. Guess we'll find out. All right, I'm going to grab these last two, make sure they're printed. So both the dining room deep clean list and the bathroom deep clean list did print well. So I'm going to continue on this template for the kitchen. And then I'm going to make one for the front porch. Kitchen. Cute. <clears throat> oh, that sucked. That's adorable. Magic recommendations. Aww. Okay, I have to use this. That is super cute.
This is all baking, though, and I don't do a lot of baking right now. I do like baking. Although I'm not so sure that I'm very good at it. Doesn't stop me from trying. I like that. That's cute. I'm going to use that one. Mm, actually, I don't know that that really fits the theme. I will use this pretzel. I'll just make it this color. Nice. And obviously, I cannot have soap in the kitchen. Let's go with... Kitchen. Yes. Ones for the kitchen aren't as clever as the ones for the bathroom. Although I say that, like, I could design my own art for this. A whole dude right there. Um, you know what? I feel like I'm the only person in the world that, one, doesn't really care for the Pioneer Woman set, and two, doesn't like, um, like the cafe theme kitchen stuff. Like, no offense if you have that and you like it, but it's like, I don't love it. I don't know. I'm, I guess it's just, I don't know. I feel like it's overused, I guess, or just, like, cheesy somehow. Nice. Okay. Also, already have the kitchen one laid out, or written out, but it's small because it just did not want to print, so. Okay, so I like to start scrub cabinet doors, and we do have a lot of cabinets, but ironically, no storage base, if that makes sense. And then I'm going to be specific. Remove all items and objects from counters. See what I mean? I can't drag this. Like I can't move this over or move this down. It's all in one piece. So I would have to just delete this. And I really don't want to do that. And then if I just if I just did like this, that would work, except for then this this is off and I can't move that either. So After this huge gap. I wonder if there's a way I can just start over. <laughs> it's fine. This is my last one. Then I have the front porch. And I probably won't use this template for the front porch. Because I've ruined it. Oh. That is not how you spell counter. And after you take all that shit off. You scrub the counters. There you go. And put everything back. But that is common sense. And I want the front of all appliances. Those nice bell appliances. Front of all appliances. Inside. Micro. The microwave or the microwave if you've seen that video. Then I want um, 
Yep, the entire sink and the the faucet. Very good. Oh, the garbage disposal to smell ni smell nice. So when I say garbage disposal, you have like a fresh tablet to things you can run through your garbage disposal, or you can just stuck stick like half a lemon down there. I don't mean like stick your hand in the garbage disposal and scrub it. Just so that everybody knows that. Mm, baseboards, take out the trash. Yes. Mm. Window seals. Aside from the baseboards, I don't really feel like this is a deep clean. I want to add, like, a thing about the stove, but I, I ran out of spots, so let me duplicate this. Just put this right there. And then I'll just put... Take everything off stove. Then scrub stove with scrub daddy power paste. Because I freaking love that stuff. Obviously, I have take out the trash already. We have window seals already. And we have vacuum and mop already, even though that could be done twice. Um, pick up dog bowls. And our laundry area shoots off of our kitchen. So I'm going to add wipe down washer and dryer. And that could be like an extra just in case I wanted to fit something in here and didn't. Okay, let's see. Did I miss anything special? Scrub the cabinet doors and take everything off the counters and scrub the counters the fronts of all appliances and inside the microwave the entire sink faucet run a lemon through the garbage disposal the baseboards take out the trash the window seals take everything off the stove and then scrub off the stove pick up the dog bowls and then wipe down the washer and dryer oh i deleted the the vacuum and mop okay so Never mind. Vacuum and mop. There we go. Okay. I feel like that's that's good for now. And we don't have a lot of light fixtures going on in the kitchen except for just the one. And that one is so old, I'm afraid to take it down until we get a new one. So for this particular list, I'm leaving that one off for right now. And I also feel like this graphic uses a lot of ink, so I'm going to change that. Let's do... Let's do these dudes. That's pretty cute. But I like more muted colors. So I'm going to make... I actually like salt and pepper I know I'm no fun there Okay, and then I want to do one for the front porch just because I want to make sure that what needs to be done on there actually gets done. Like, the front porch is just 
Uh, let's see if there's art for front porch. I mean, kind of, yeah. There's kind of for a front porch. We need to add those plants back. I don't know what that is supposed to be. That will work. That will work. That is not a front porch. And then let's just do a garden hose. Let's do this one. So you will go here. Great. You will go here. And by natural selection, you will go here. And then I'm just uh, torch. I'm going to do garden because a lot of times. Porches and gardens. Fitting. Because that's what we need to do to our front porch. And none of us smoke, so I can't put a big old cigarette on there. <laughs> that would be so funny. Actually, it would not be very classy, but it would be funny. We don't have a porch swing, but we have like a two seater and another like a glider. So let me do porch swing. I could have done patio furniture. See if they have one. See, it's that's a porch swing or just a swing, and we don't have that. We just have. Hmm. Ooh, I would love to have a hammock, though. I'm going to ask for that for my birthday. Like, hammocks are super expensive, though. It's kind of like that, but it's not a swing. I got an idea. Iced tea, because that's what we do with our porch in the summer. We drink iced tea on it. Aw, mint iced tea. There we go. Nice. Okay. I don't have a porch list to go off of yet, but let's do take all, all nonsense. That's not useful nonsense. Take all nonsense off porch. So anything that doesn't belong on the porch. You know what I'm going to do? I'm going to just, I'm going to delete this one probably and duplicate. I'm going to duplicate this section. Wait. What? Okay, no. 
I'm meant to duplicate it, not delete it. Duplicate. I'm going to delete that and just start over. There we go. Okay. Remove. If I can figure out how to spell remove. Still can't spell nonsense either. Move on nonsense. And then you don't have to carry the furniture off the porch, but I do want to move the furniture to sleep under it. I always spell furniture wrong. I know it's with an I. Sweep entire porch. Sweep walls for cobwebs. We don't really have a whole lot of co cobwebs. Sorry. We don't really have a whole lot of cobwebs because we have um, this nice little company come and spray and do their thing. And so, yeah, we don't really get bugs. Um... Sweep around window. Clean window. Then once all the crap is off the porch and everything's been swept and everything has been wiped down. Get. Get out pressure washer or the garden hose if you're just, you know, spray off entire porch. Add dish soap to mm. Dang it, use dish soap. Okay. So, get dish soap. I'm trying to figure out how to do that. Oh, hold on. I can move I can move this one down a little. Okay, use dish soap in each Is it corner? Yeah, there we go. In each corner. Use broom to scrub floor. Pressure wash, soap away. Sure, steps are clear. Oh my gosh. Why? I need a new keyboard.
steps. Make sure steps are clear. And put everything back. Spray furniture it if needed. That seems fair for a porch list. I actually don't mind doing that on the porch, especially in the summer. I really don't mind. I haven't done it in the winter. And because I don't know where a pressure washer is, I'm probably just going to have to use the garden hose. All right. So I have covered uh, all the rooms that are going to be important for this. I did not do our bedroom and the kids have their own bedroom list. Um, then I have uh, our room, which honestly could use a list. So um, I will be making an adult chore chart list just for our room, just because I'm scatterbrained and my poor husband works a lot. And it would just help to look over instead of looking at the entire room being like, oh, shit, we have so much to do. And being like, OK here's what we actually have to do it just helps okay so that was um almost a whole hour stream of me just making cleaning lists and i'm sure i don't know if this is helpful for anyone but me i don't know maybe i should just take pictures or little videos of the list once they're done and put them on tiktok or i don't know i really don't know it's not the direction i'm gonna go with this stream uh, I just thought it would be fun for today. So, yeah. I hope uh, all three of you enjoyed this. And uh, let me know what you think and if this is helpful to you. Thank you very much if you took any time out of your day to watch this. Uh, I super appreciate you and your patience. And I will see you in my next game session or the next time I do anything mildly stream-worthy. Thank you and goodbye.